What is your response to those who say that it is a satanic enterprise or some sort of devil worshipping? Yes, I think it's all about uh, ignorance. Hello, this is Anushka TV and welcome back to the plugin show powered by Joseph Building and Construction Company where the future of your house belongs. There have been a lot of speculating stories talking about Freemasonry. Everywhere you go around on social media, you go around on magazines, you go around on radios, you go around televisions, everywhere. Someone telling someone about an experience or a story he or she had from another person. Now today, you'll get to hear the whole story narrated by one of the Freemason member Ambrose Rachie. What is your response to those who say that it is a satanic enterprise or some sort of devil worshipping? Yes, I think it's all about uh, ignorance. If you get to the Masonic Hall, the first thing is what the kings, it's a citation from King Solomon to God that I shall build you a house and you shall establish your throne forever. It is reference to building of a temple of God. Nothing could be further than satanic from that reference. And indeed, masonry is about building a temple. And that's why we have degrees of builders. I think most of it are talking from point of view of Christianity, yet masonry does not, is not based on any particular religion. We have Muslims in Freemasonry, we have Christians, we have Buddhists, and of course a few, you could also have a few atheists, and so, so that there is no reference whatsoever to issues of devil worship whoever the devil is. There's a notion out there that people join the Freemason Society uh, ostensibly to acquire wealth mm. and power. What is your comment? Uh, none of those, uh, none of, the, of, the, of those two. Um, we join Freemasonry to propagate charity. Uh, and uh, there's a few wealthy people in Freemasonry then there are those people who just live ordinary lives, like myself. I'm not a wealthy person, and I'm not a I'm not a powerful person. In fact, most of the people there are just simple Kenyans. Some of them businessmen. Some of them are medical practitioners. Some of them are lawyers, and uh, there is no discrimination as to what kind of person you are. All I can say is that there are very few politicians, if I remember. I don't think we have any politician. Some of us are, some of them are judges of our courts, and all kind of things. So it's a mixture, and the common denominator is not wealth. The common denominator is charitable practices. Maybe if you could just break it down for us. How does one become a free mason? Yes. Um, first is, uh, uh, once you get to hear about it and you are lucky to get, to get in there, I'm saying lucky in the sense that unless you get to know about it from somebody else, you may never be interested in it. And in particular, with these negative attitudes that are being propagated by ignorant people, uh, you will never hear about it. So somebody who is an insider, like I have been there in 1984, I would find it something good, something that you would want to invite a friend of yours. So I might say that, look, uh, Mr. Heinz, I'm looking at you, I think you're a very good man. It's about good people. It's a good man, you, you like charity work, you like helping people, and all kinds of things. So I will tell you, Mr. Heinz, would you mind my introducing you to this? And I will give you a little bit of a talk. And uh, after that, um, I would then propose, I would go to a meeting and propose that I have somebody who should, I think I should introduce 
you were then invited for an interview. We talked to you about a few things. In particular, we are concerned about your family, what your family will think about you because of all these negative things. Uh, if there's any objection from you. Uh, so it will then be announced. It's just like you know, publishing a, a, a publication for a, for a wedding. So we'll say, okay, anybody with an objection. So it will go on. We will be there for some time. Like I'm proposing to open the, the post and we give time to anybody who objects. If there's anybody who objects, then you will not come in. And the objection will be somebody who knows you have negative character. So from there, you will, there is no objection, you will be initiated, you will be brought in and uh, welcomed and shown what it is all about. Now, the, now, this has caused a mixed reaction on social media over the Freemasonic Maestri that just aired on one of the Kenyan top television channels in Kenya.